<laughs> Make sure you ain't getting away. <laughs> You guys, what's happening? Today, I'm out here with two of my really good buddies. Jay right here, Colton right here, and Colton, uh, how many times have you been on this boat? This is number one, man, first time. First time. You guys hear that? You come out on my boat, then I uh, let you drive it. So, this is Colton's <laughs> first time. He's out on my boat, and he's kind of on the wheel. So, we've got Captain Colton, we've got Jay right here, and today is a very special video. Jay and I, we've had this video planned for like two months. We haven't been able to get to it because the weather winds have just been horrible. Jay, what are we doing today? We are catching some Spanish mackerels and making sushi out of it on the boat. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, you guys. Today, Jay, he went to the grocery store and he had to go to like three grocery stores this morning because none of them would actually sell him rice, uh, sushi rice. Look at that big old Ray right here. Dang. But anyways, so today you guys, we are catching sushi. Literally, we're catching sushi. We're gonna catch Spanish mackerel and we're gonna make it into sushi. So we've got my cutting board right here. Uh, we've got, in the cooler, we've got rice. Um, but we've also got a whole bunch of other poles and rigs. Maybe uh, we'll get on some cobia, who knows. But the name of the game today is we are going to, cause Spanish mackerel is such a good eating fish and it makes for excellent sushi, excellent sashimi. Right now, we're about to get ran over by the dolphin tours behind us. Check it out. Dolphin tour boat. How you doing? No waves. I got one wave. One wow. Lady. <laughs> Didn't get any waves. So anyways, that's the name of the game today. We are going to go fishing for sushi on the boat. That's what's happening, sashimi. All right, so when you guys are working these Spanish mackerel, all it is, got your plugs, and you know, it's kind of like Mortal Kombat when you like just push <laughs> buttons. That's pretty much what Spanish mackerel is like. You just, you know, do stuff with the lure. You know, it's not like finesse fishing at all. You can jerk it, reel it in straight. But the biggest thing is that you just give your lure some sort of erratic motion and there he is. Oh! Anyways, when you guys are fishing for Spanish mackerel, you know, sometimes you can like, what I sometimes like to do is um, I'll let it sink and I'll give it some pops like that on the bottom and that's when they'll pick it up. <laughs> Look at that blue fish. Come on, get up. I'm gonna start talking like that and see if I catch it. <laughs> you know guys, um, <laughs> here in <laughs> Dude, you can use one of my gotcha plugs. This is one of yours. It is? Uh -huh. Use another one. <laughs> there he is. There he is. Oh. He feels bigger. Come on. Be a 30 incher. Don't be a blue fish. I don't know. I think it's a blue. Watch him if he's sideways. I think it's a bluefish. I don't know, he's swimming kind of fast. Now, nah, bluefish! Alright. Come here, boy. Oh! oh shit. Ah, that hurt! Oh my oh. god, that hurt! Where'd it go? Right in your calf, dog. Yeah, I know. Right there. Good thing it didn't go deep. Oh, <laughs> you saw that too, didn't yes, you? Yes, I saw that in slow motion. <laughs> oh man, that was a close call. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all, these conditions for Spanish are like absolutely ideal because we have pretty much everything that we want to look for. We have structure over here. We have moving water. The current is ripping out. And we also have straight ahead like some nasty muddy water and we're fishing in clearer water and uh so it's kind of like everything we've got structure we've got current we've got bait and we've got clean water if you can find an area that you've got all those things and there's spanish mackerel in your fishery I guarantee you that you will hook up Please don't be a blue fish. That looks shiny like a Spanish. Yeah, that's a good one. Hey, 
y'all. That is like an awesome size eating Spanish mackerel. Woohoo! So what I'm doing is just using these gotcha plugs and just like a trout rod, bass rod, whatever you want to call it rod. Uh, light, medium action, 3000 series. And super fun, super easy. Just casting it and reeling it back in nice and quick like. Nice. Hooked up, oh, hooked up. One, Is it? Yeah. Okay, let me get the net. I got it. We got a big one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ooh, yes, yeah. son. At least, I would say 21 and a half. 21 and a half, <laughs> that's your guess? <laughs> yeah. All right, y'all, Colton oh. just hooked up on a decent size Spanish and we all have takers as to uh, how big it is calm down buddy control your fish Cut just rip it rip his jaw I don't want to that's like a little stuff. king Dang. hold him up hoist him all off hoist him up oh. <laughs> don't worry we'll it's edit this right. out I of the video <laughs> I hope you're a little cooler over here I know that all right, show him the YouTube. There it is, y'all. Colton on his first legit oh, Spaniard. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, into the cooler. Jack. Sweet. Heck yeah, buddy. Right on. Nice catch, brother. I feel like I actually catch something. Yeah, Jay. Oh, there we go. Hooked up, boys. Right I'm hooked up. I can't talk, man. I'm busy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. He's a nice one. Real nice. nice 12 inches. Going right in the cooler. That's a 14 right there. Yeah, it is. What'd you say? Yeah. yeah. Dang, you were on to something back here. Ah! Oh! oh. I'm good. I know, right? Whew, close call. <laughs> Alright, y'all. There it is. That's not the size of Colton's, but that's a fun one. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, he pulled off. You want it done about there? Yeah, right. How, ooh. I don't want, oh, he's hanging on there. Barely, barely. <laughs> okay, okay, hold on. Here we go, here we go. Here we go. Gotta finesse him into the net. <laughs> <laughs> that is a nice one. Thank you. Hey, you grab him this time. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I bet. I saw a lot of energy. Nope, there he is. There he is. Oh, yeah. Got one. He ain't networking. <laughs> yeah. He's swimming right towards the boat, dude, like a trout. Look at him. He is, I know. Come in here. Right into my cooler. Alright, I'm not messing around with this guy. I'm using pliers. Trouble hooks, you love them when you're hooking fish. You hate them when you're unhooking it. Oh yeah. Or when you're like in your truck or you're like, why do I use treble hooks? Or maybe in your finger? Yeah. <laughs> I got I got I've gotten them hooked in my waders. And you gotta cut, oh, a, cut a piece of your waiter off. I think the war is in the net. Yeah. Alright, y'all. There it is. Another beautiful Spanish mackerel. Yeah. 
There he is. There he is. That is a Spaniard. <laughs> Keep precise. All right, we are officially slay status. There we go. Easiest way to unhook him. There he is. Oh, really, Jack? <laughs> I'll tell y'all what that's a good problem to have when your rod has scales all over it <laughs> that far right? that towel. i know oh man oh right at the top <laughs> hey ain't a bad one i know where are these waves coming from come in here you don't know that is a beautiful Spanish mackerel. That's, I think, legit. We're like getting close to number 30. In there, boy. Wow. We need to get some ice. Thanks, brother. Appreciate it. That's going to be a heavy bag. Yeah, it is. So, uh, today we slayed the Spanish mackerel. This cooler that Jay brought is absolutely loaded. Actually, it like bursted at the seams with so much so much fish in here. So um, for doing um, sushi and sashimi, they say it is best fresh, but you want to give your fish like, I don't know, like 15 to 20 minutes for the muscles to relax. Um, I guess that's, or the meat maybe, that's kind of what I heard. All right, we'll start with this guy. He's got a little bit more meat on him. So these have just been caught, um, yeah, less than an hour ago. Put them on ice, and we're going to go ahead and we're going to fillet this guy, and we're going to make us some sushi right here on the boat. Spanish mackerel are super easy to fillet. Dang, that meat looks good. That's, yeah, that does look good. All right, there's our Spanish that is filleted. Go ahead, throw him in the water. The Spanish have just a little bit of a bloodline, so we just cut that out. Comes out super easy. Howdy. <laughs> That looks amazing. Look at that. Look how, like, that is just fresh, fresh Spanish mackerel. You guys can do this on your pier, uh, your beach, anywhere. It's super, super easy. Just fillet your fresh Spanish mackerel on ice. Oh yeah, dude, that's way better. See? All right, y'all. Now what we're doing is this one, we took the skin off of it, and that looks amazing. Yeah, that looks good. Go ahead and discard that. Way better. Dang. That looks so good. We're not pro here by any means. We are not pro, but it does look very good. It's all about presentation. Just give me a second. Uh, there it is. Sushi is all about presentation. And so we have our fresh Spanish mackerel. We have our sushi fillets right here. It's not perfect, but we have our, uh, you know, we got our sashimi right here, sashimi meat. And then we've got our sushi on rice. So this is rice that actually Jay picked up from Harris Teeter. And I'm gonna give these guys a, uh, a taste test. 
actually does look really good. It's all you, brah. All right, here we go. Taste test. Spanish mackerel. Right. right there. Got left the skin on this one. A little bit of rice. <laughs> so good. It's not even gamey at all. Tastes like fresh water. Dude. That tastes so good. I can smell the soy sauce. Really? I went light on soy sauce. It's a lot of meat, but dude, hit a close up on that. That is sick. Look at that, you guys. You guys, that is some high quality sushi grade meat. We literally today, we went out and mission accomplished. We caught sushi. That is awesome. Look at that. Y'all, so, anyways, here we go. We're gonna do a little taste test here. My buddy Colton, you know, this is my piece of sashimi. Colton's got a little piece, some rice on it. What'd you think? <clears throat> awesome, yeah, it's awesome. Anyways, all right, you guys, that's it. Spanish mackerel, gotcha plugs, and mission accomplished today. So, we got some fresh sushi. And we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna fillet up the rest of this and all the other Spanish mackerel that we got. And um, that's pretty much it, y'all. So hope y'all enjoyed that little catch and cook. You guys do the same. Catch yourself some Spanish, make yourself some sushi. Peace out.